This is Brian McLaughlin with LearnToGrapple.com. We're going to look at a darse off a wraparound entry. So I'm beginning in side control. I'm going to be looking to set up my wraparound choke. To set up my wraparound, I have to come inside his elbow. I, I kind of face his hips here. I'm waiting for him to lift this arm up or to push into me so that I can wrap around and under his head. Now I have a very powerful choke here, and we broke it down uh, in a prior breakdown. But what's going to happen a lot of times is the person's going to realize if they turn this shoulder to the ceiling here, they can fight my finish. Very common. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this arm and I'm just going to come through for the dars. I'm going to bring it between our bodies. I like to come inside my knee, rotate to the back of his head, and I throw this like an uppercut. I'm looking to get the bend of my arm right underneath his chin to his carotid. Okay, the same way you would do a rear naked choke. I now go off the head, catch the bicep. There's a lot of ways you can finish the dars at this point. The important thing is that your weight is here. What I like doing is I sit through, I take this far foot, I find the hip. Okay, I'm squeezing my elbows together, arching back and squeezing. Uh, we call this the Donaher finish to the Dars. I was at a, uh, a seminar and uh, one of his students showed me this uh, and he ended up telling me that it was uh, a John Donaher showed him to finish the Dars. I'm here, I'm coming inside, I get the legs and pushes. I swing my arm around trying to get my wrap around. He turns into me. Switch through the dart, sit for my hip, foot on the hip, arch back, squeeze together. Common mistakes that people will encounter with this. The main one is in the transition. They'll come up really well here, then they'll let go entirely to try to get the darts. The problem is if I let go, this arm's gonna come out, okay? Or not even that, he'll just, just pull his arm out entirely, okay? So you want to make sure when you're here, you don't give them that opportunity. One arm replaces the other. This arm's going to come through, then this arm comes in. He's not going to have the opportunity to switch. Now once I'm here, a lot of people will, will fall the wrong way. I see this a lot. Okay? Fall to the elbow. That's what I think. Whichever elbow arm you're grabbing, fall to that elbow. And then you're going to have a nice easy finish. So one more time. So this is our Dars from a wraparound choke entry from side control.